Top-ranked tennis player and instructor John Paulus had a difficult decision to make. Pain from knee arthritis threatened to end his career. When you're trying to sleep at nighttime and you roll over to a certain position and your knees wake you up, then uh, you know something's not right. John's doctors recommended total knee replacement surgery to treat his knee arthritis. The knee replacement is usually done for pain relief. That's most often the thing that we do. Um, they have uh, enough pain and enough limitation in terms of what they can do because of their knee arthritis that it comes time that something needs to be done. The, the benefits of knee replacements for patients, uh, I think the, the uh, most outstanding benefit is just pain relief. Uh, improved mobility, improved function. Um, uh, a lot of the people that get joint replacements are really in a lot of pain and, and after the surgery uh, uh, there oftentimes is a dramatic improvement and uh, the average patient is very happy with the outcomes for their knee replacement. John decided to have knee replacement surgery at St. Mary's Hospital in Madison, Wisconsin. I felt so confident, so sure with it, I said, look, if you got an opening tomorrow morning, uh, I'll be there. And uh, I mean, that, that's a testimonial to, to my confidence with, not only with, say, the St. Mary's, with Dean, with Dr. Rick Glad, in whatever order you want to put those. Most of the people that come in to have this surgery have already reached a point where they have given up doing the things that they want to do uh, because the knee restricts them. And um, afterwards, uh, for the most part, people are re able to return to activities that they have given up within reason. I mean, we certainly have people that uh, are walking, uh, you know, playing golf, pursuing activities of daily living uh, fairly comfortably. Straight on with the ball. After knee replacement surgery, John's mobility began to return. First time I could actually take with a crutch to sort of protect myself and hit a ball against a wall or have somebody just feed one out to me, which I'd love to. Mentally, it was, it was so refreshing. There's nothing like it. I mean, nothing to describe the feeling about how bad it was before to how good it was afterwards. I mean, that's one of the gratifying things as their doctor is that they say, hey, thanks for giving me my life back. I can go back to doing all the things I want to do. Their exercise, and their, whether they're walking or riding a bike or swimming or whatever they like to do, hiking. If they're, uh, if they're back to, to being able to go to work, they're comfortable because they're not tired all the time. They haven't had their sleep disturbed by their knee pain. And so all those things improve their quality of life, quality of life quite a bit. Today, John has returned to teaching tennis and competes internationally in his age group. A world of difference because uh, I couldn't run at all. Um, one, getting up and down step free of hands on railings, uh, that I couldn't do. Uh, getting in and out of the car with the freedom of, of discomfort, basically pain with the knee, uh, all those are relief. You can learn more about knee replacement surgery during a live webcast from St. Mary's Hospital in Madison, Wisconsin. Surgeons will demonstrate a live total knee replacement surgery with commentary by experts in orthopedic surgery. OR Live makes it easy for you to learn more. Just click on the request information button on your webcast screen and open the door to informed medical care. Join us on January 22nd at 4 p.m. Central Time for a webcast of a total knee replacement surgery, live from St. Mary's Hospital in Madison, Wisconsin.